Hi everybody, welcome to the Jones Journey. I'm Bless Bro and I'm here with my week three update. Um, first I wanna welcome y'all. I'm gonna tell y'all I am eating. I have my lunch, brunch, breakfast. This is my first meal of the day. This is um some rice. It's, it's actually a steamer bag. It had like rice in it. And so this is the first time that I had this. I steamed it in the microwave and then I had some chopped onions and bell peppers. So I put them in a the pan, I sprayed some nonstick spray in it. And after the rice, cause I was gonna mix it together, but after the rice got finished steaming, I just decided to put it in the pan. And so that's what I did. And I, I might've left it in a little long cause I was like, I can make my own fried rice. I did not add oil to it, just a nonstick spray. But it tastes pretty good. Um, yeah, huh? Let's have my lunch. The only thing that I probably would do different, I left it in the pot on the eye, the pan on the eye, after it finished, and I think I got a little crispy on the bottom for me. But that's it. I added some onion powder and garlic powder. I was gonna go live and eat this with y'all, but I, um, I'm in the middle of doing stuff. I actually have to go see some patients and um and I'm making baskets. I, I might show y'all what I got going on over here. I was supposed to have already finished the baskets. This is my Tuesday way in um my Tuesday update, but I this is today is Wednesday. And I was gonna go live because I don't plan on editing this. And if I don't talk too much, I won't edit it. But sometimes I talk a lot, y'all know that. But I can't talk a lot today because I gotta go to work. Anyway, so I came over here. I actually have my um scrub bottoms i have my scrub top on but i don't like smelling like onions i know y'all probably heard me say that before and so when i pull it when i pull the onions and bell peppers out then that's when i just change and put this on i also have a water this is room temperature i drink my water it's cold or room temperature and i do have me a kombucha um that i need to put in the refrigerator i stopped by piggly wiggly on the way here and um, I was gonna get me some, okay, I was gonna get me some microwave potatoes. You know, the little potato company, they have potatoes. They have them at Walmart and Piggly Wiggly had them before. And when I was eating all vegetables in the past, I have, I'm actually purchased them. Now, uh, in my mind, my first thing that I was thinking, because my iron uh, is low and I can tell my iron is low and, and I say I have anemia. And this morning, when I woke up, I could tell my iron was low, my head was hurting, and the way I feel, you know, you're tired. Ooh, don't fall. But anyway, so I was like, I need to take my iron pill. I need to get something in me, you know, so that I can take my medicine and um, feel better. My vitamin, my iron. But anyway, so I was like, I'm just getting ready to go to, go to Peak Wiggly. I was leaving the other house. I don't live here. So I was leaving the other house, and I said, on my way over there to the other house, um, to the content house i'm gonna stop by piggly wiggly and get me some vegan sausage because i used to eat that and i don't remember it making me feel bad but when i got it then well then my mind thought about the little potato company and i was like i could get some potatoes and cook them right quick because so i was trying to think of something quick to eat because i gotta go to work and i have to do these baskets i have to see well two four or five patients today um but I, after I thought about the little potato company, I went to Piggly Wiggly, and they actually didn't have the potatoes in the bag that was are, that were already ready, or the little potato company, or any of those I didn't see in the um, section. And I asked the lady that was working back there, the produce section, and she showed me some mini potatoes that were in a bag. You know, it was like five dollars. So uh, you know, I had to wash them. Well, I had to wash the little potato company too. That's another story. Anyway. And they're supposed to, you, you're not supposed to have to wash them. But these were in a little, a little bit in a bag and I was like, $5, you know, I can just get a big, a bigger potato and put it in the microwave. I was trying to think of something as an alternative to eating the processed fake meat. And then to put one baked potato, microwave potatoes, like $2. Yeah, and I was just like, never mind, just bump it. <laughs> Let me go check out the fake meat. When I got the fake meat, so I was on my way to the fake meat, and then I noticed the vegetables, the steam fresh vegetables were 
three for five. And I was like, okay, let me look at these. And I saw some broccoli. I got me some broccoli. And then I saw this rice with vegetables in it. And I was like, let me try it. <laughs> I've never had this before. And I don't. This is in three weeks. Let me see. This is my, oh, no. I was going to say this is my first time having rice. It is not. Um, since I've been eating all vegetables, this is the third. This is the first time that I have um cooked rice. I should say I cooked it um myself. I had have some veggie fajitas from a Mexican place, and then I had um that comes with a little bit of rice. No, I told them no sour cream and no cheese on anything. So I and I also had a veggie vegetable fried rice. From Chinese place. So the veggie fajitas were delicious. I've had them before and they probably have too much oil. I don't know. But anyway, they tasted dirty. The the vegetables were like it wasn't dirty like big pieces of dirt. But they were dirty like these people probably got them and didn't wash their vegetables. And they might not ever wash their vegetables. I don't know. And maybe they do watch them wash them. Maybe they just got extra dirty vegetables. But the flavor was good, but the dirt, mm -mm. so <laughs> thumbs up to them because I won't be getting any more of those. No times, and I don't know if I'll ever get them. I, I know, but right now, you know, it's like, mm -mm. I got dirt. <laughs> Never mind. And then the vegetable fried rice, it was okay, you know, but the vegetable fried rice made me feel bad after I ate it. If I consume something that has a lot of MSG, it makes me feel like I'm awake. And then it makes me feel like Phew. somebody just pulled the shades down. And I start feeling like, Ugh, not good. And so I'm not saying that that was going on with my vegetable fried rice, but it just made me feel not good. Like I was up and it made me feel down. So I won't be getting that again. This is my first time cooking the rice. And so this will be my third rice in the three weeks. And I went to a vegan cafe. And I've been there in the past. I'm thinking when I was eating, like one of my times when I was eating all vegetables, we went there. And it made the food that we had, made my husband feel bad. Excuse me, but I don't recall it making me feel bad. When he started feeling bad, I was like, are you okay? And he was like, he didn't feel good. And I was like, oh, well, it didn't make me feel bad. It didn't, but I don't remember it. Because I would have remembered it. I think because it made him feel bad. But, um... I went this time and where everything was okay because the vegetables give me I get I have good energy. When I tell you good energy, hmm, I have a lot of good energy. And so I'm up and down, woo, woo, woo. And then it, after I eat, it's like, mm mm. Hmm. So I won't be going there again. And the 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 vegan places, uh, which I am not a vegan. <laughs> Uh, some they're hard to find sometimes and I was out working and so and I thought ate this it was it tasted really good and I was like I'm gonna I can go around when I go out of town to work I can just stop by vegan places and eat and do like a vegan review like in my car y'all know those youtubers who do reviews and, and the food looks good and then they tell you how it tastes and I said I could do that but after I ate that I was like the show is canceled <laughs> I think that a lot of people do use like MSG and artificial stuff to enhance the flavor of uh, the vegan veg, uh, the vegan processed stuff. I say it like that. Yeah, and I think that that may contain a lot of MSG, and it also contains a lot of stuff that you know that we don't know how to pronounce. I don't know how to pronounce. In my mind, it's like I'm making this harder than it has to be. In the past, I did eat the fake meat. And um, this time, I want to do more natural and stay away from the fake meat. I did not eat the Impossible Whopper this week. Yay. <laughs> like my goal was to not eat it for the rest of the month. Not this month of me eating for the whole, like the rest of May. And I probably, like now, you know, I'm just like, mm -mm, I'm staying away from stuff like that. Um, so I did good on that. I did eat all vegetables and fruit this week. Yay. I'm staying for that. And so my th three week update, I, I did lose weight. Yay. And, um, so we're sticking on the, our path. The only thing that I'm 
working towards now is not eating chips. <laughs> I did eat chips. I know potato chips vegan. Ooh, I'm telling y'all. Okay. I prefer potato chips. Like, I, I'm the salty person, not the sweet person. Some people, like, love sweets. And some people, like, salt the salty snacks. So, I'm the salty kind of snack person. And eating the fruit and fruit and vegetables, I'm eating more fruit, like, more and more fruit this time. Even when I only ate, when I didn't eat meat in the past, I didn't eat this, this much fruit. But I'm eating more fruit now. But them chips... <laughs> I think that's what's hindering me a lot. I got to say, and I know they have a lot of artificial and processed stuff in them chips. <sighs> yeah. So I got to stay away from the chips. That's my only problem. So we're going to make it my goal for this week. Because I did eat chips. Yes, <laughs> so starting when we got to start with kids today is Wednesday, so we got to say from Thursday until next Tuesday, we're not gonna eat any chips. Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, which next Tuesday will be my four week weigh in day, anyway, which is good, y'all. That means, um, I gotta check the exact date, but I'm I said I was gonna eat, um, no meat, no dairy eating plants for a month so i'm gonna check the exact date that i started and then yeah we'll be our month is coming up and we're doing good okay so when i weighed myself in yesterday morning i lost dun, 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 dun. One, one, one. i lost one pound again y'all so that brings my total to 14 pounds the first week was like 12 pounds, yes. Then the second week was a pound. This week was a pound. It's some potato chips in that fake meat, I think. I need to go to bed earlier. And um, I need to drink more water. I don't drink as much water as I should. And I don't get as much rest as I should. So I'm um, making my goal this week, no potato chips. So we're going to work on going to bed by 10 and we don't have any chips and I gotta consciously uh, be conscious of how much water I may drink this week. I didn't think about that. I need to try to drink. So we got water, no chips and rest. Okay, water, no chips and rest. Water, no chips and rest. Three things, water, no chips and rest. That's what I'm gonna work on this. Week. Oh, my raw days. I did one full day of raw. Yo. I'm gonna get the processed fake meat out. And then we're gonna do uh, water and we're gonna do more rest. And then Mother's Day is Sunday. Yes, it is. And I am a mother. Yes, I am. And my family wants to take me out. Yes, they do. Um, but I said, I told them, I said, you can take me anywhere. But I'm eating vegetables. So be hanging in there. Yeah, my husband's birthday is later this month. And. We'll see what we're going to do. My four weeks will be up then. But even when my four weeks is up, I'm still going to... I'm enjoying this. I'm enjoying the energy. Oh, my goodness. It's, I've been on here for 20 minutes. i got to go to work. But I got to tell y'all, I'm going to have to make a, a video showing, telling y'all about these benefits that I have. The benefits of... Since I stopped eating meat, oh, my goodness. Everything is great. But I got to go. I got to go. I got to go. Like, out of town. Okay, I love you guys. Thank you so much. If you have stayed for this long, please give me a purple heart. So let me know you're watching. Make a comment below. Let me know what you think. Tell me if I'm good, I'm bad. Give me, you can give me suggestions. Whatever you think, I'm too fat. I'm losing too much weight. <laughs> oh, anyway, have a blessed and beautiful day. Remember to always put God first in everything you do. Join me again next time for my update. Next week is going to be the big four-week reveal.